Introduction Symmetry is an important geometrical concept commonly exhibited in nature like some flowers, animals, etc. We also observe symmetry in art, architecture and nature. Some examples of symmetry in nature are arrangement of needles on a pine tree, arrangement of petal in flowers, leaves, butterflies, etc. A figure has a line symmetry if there is a line about which a figure may be folded so that the two parts of the figure will coincide. Example from nature. In the brackets, having a line of symmetry. 1. Butterfly. 2. Taj Mahal. 3. Sunflower. Some geometrical figures having a line of symmetry given below. Line of symmetry for regular polygons. An equilateral triangle is a regular polygon because each of its sides has same length and each of its angles measures 60 degree. We have three lines of symmetry for an equilateral triangle. Square. A square is a regular polygon as it has all four sides equal and all angles right angle. We have four lines of symmetry for a square. Regular pentagon. A regular pentagon is a regular polygon having five sides equal and its five angles are also equal. A regular pentagon has five lines of symmetry. Regular hexagon. A regular hexagon has six equal sides and hence its six angles are also equal. Can you guess how many lines of symmetry does it have? Yes, it will have six lines of symmetry. Thus, a regular hexagon have six lines of symmetry. Mirror reflection. The concept of line symmetry is closely related to the mirror reflection. If a figure has a line of symmetry and if we place a mirror along the line of symmetry, then the image or reflection of one side of the figure is exactly same as the figure on the other side of the line of symmetry. So, we call the line of symmetry of figures as reflection symmetry. We need to take care of left-right changes when we deal with mirror reflection. Rotational Symmetry The turning of a figure about a fixed point is defined as rotation. Rotation may be clockwise or anti-clockwise. The fixed point about which rotation takes place is called the center of rotation. When an object rotates, its shape and size do not change. The angle of turning during rotation is called the angle of rotation. A full turn means a rotation of 360 degree. A half turn means a rotation of 180 degree. And a quarter turn means a rotation of 90 degree. Order of rotation. The number of times a figure fits onto itself in one full turn is called order of rotation in symmetry. The shape of a paper windmill is as shown below. In a full turn, there are precisely four positions when the windmill looks exactly the same. So, we say that a paper windmill has a rotational symmetry of order 4. Thus, order of rotational symmetry of a shape can be calculated by taking out the quotient of 360 degree by its angle of rotation. In the case of paper windmill, order of rotation is equal to 360 degree by 90 degree is equal to 4. Square. The square also has rotational symmetry of order 4 as it can be rotated 4 times to take a complete rotation and each time it looks exactly the same. So, a square has rotational symmetry of order 4. Rectangle. A rectangle also has rotational symmetry but its order is 2 as in only 2 positions it looks exactly the same. Example 1. A. Can you tell the order of rotational symmetry for an equilateral triangle? B. How many positions are there at which the triangle looks exactly the same when rotated about its center by 120 degree? Solution A. Order of rotational symmetry of an equilateral triangle is 3. B. At 3 position, the triangle looks exactly the same when rotated about the center by 120 degree. 